This cat literally sleeps all day long. What's going on people? How you all doing? Right, today I'm actually going to meet up with a friend of mine called Bridie. I've actually done a video with her about four or five months ago. I'll stick it in quickly now so you can check it out. The way I look at my cakes is cakes on my canvas and it's just a way to explore the art in me which I really feel I need to get out. Cool. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go meet up with her. We're going to go and grab a drink. I'd kind of like to meet up with her every now and then. She's kind of doing her own business. I'm kind of doing mine. And it's just nice to kind of chat to someone who's on the same wavelength, going through similar kind of stuff as you. So yeah, but she's sick. I really actually look up to her in quite a lot of ways. And then afterwards, I'm going to take my laptop and a couple of other bits. I need to do a little bit of storyboarding and I need to plan these shoots I've got going on this weekend. So Saturday, I've got a wedding. Sunday, I'm shooting a promotional video for a new pop-up theme thing that's going on so yeah they're gonna be good I will catch you in Brentwood later on Yo, yo, bloody hell, that lens is well dirty. Yo, 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 people, what is going on? So, right, I'm in Brentwood, and a bit of an issue, yeah? I stepped outside and it was a little bit cold, that's why I chucked on the shirt, but it's actually quite hot now, so... <sighs> Might have to go and take it back to the whip. Can you believe Friday got a drink without me? Fuming. Hi, are you all right? Hi. Uh, can I get a... Uh, Caramel cream for frappuccino, please. Yes, please. Is there cream on top as well? Uh, I best not. Cheers. Can I take your name? Yeah, James. Caramel cream. Oh, caramel cream, James. Yeah, you got a bit of that yourself. Cheers. Yeah. Thank you very much. <laughs> Cheers. What one was that? Oh, yeah, but they're, they're all vloggers. It's, it's a bit geeky, isn't it? Like, it's not a bit geeky, it's majorly geeky. Wasn't that a bit like... Oh God, it's not working. Well, wasn't it a bit like... A bit hard, she was all doing the same. <laughs> oh, like, no, it's like, like we... Spaces. No, not really, like, it's just we, we all kind of do, we all kind of like doing the same thing. Yeah. But, because we all kind of know, like we know what we're doing, but I mean... Um, but you know the guy that was talking about? No, no, no. Yeah, I think so. What's going on, people? So, me and Bradley have just gone and had a really nice little coffee. Um, we're just walking down the high street. I'm going to see how uh, see how confident Bridie is just yeah. look, talking to a camera in front of a load of people that she probably actually knows. Yeah, we so, know the same people. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, no, we had a good time, didn't we? We, yeah, we talked did. a little bit about like kind of business and kind of what's going on with life and stuff because. It's always nice to catch up with people that are kind of doing the same thing as you. So yeah. And that you've known for years. Yeah, and that you've known for ages. So yeah, it's nice. But yeah, I need to go and do a bit of work now. Bridie's going to go back. You got to wait for cakes today, yeah. Now. I'm going to yeah. make a luxury cake. So I'll do that when I get back. Lovely. Yeah, I'll um I'll link all of Bridie's stuff in the description so you can go and check out her stuff. Her cakes are incredible. Honestly, uh -huh. you've got to go and see them. And her Instagram is just well, you invented the cake. Impeccable. Cake. Yeah, yeah, we well, well we kind of done it together, yeah. yeah. So I'm, I'll put that. I already showed you that earlier, so because I, I made like an introduction where I, I said, oh yeah, do. I'm gonna go and meet Bridie today. I made we made this video a couple of months ago. I'm gonna put it in here, so we'll yeah. Have to do another one. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm, I'm pretty sure that we'll definitely be doing something yeah. else soon. So yeah, check out here. Damn man, fuck. fuck. I miss riding this skateboard, man. I love riding it in Budapest, but now it's like, oh god. There's nowhere to ride it no more. Anyway, just got back. I didn't end up staying in Brentwood. I was going to stay in Brentwood and do my work there, but I thought, you know what, no, I'm just going to go home and get it done. Got to prepare for two shoots this weekend. Got a wedding on Saturday, which I'm going to try and put like a little twist on it compared to what I usually do. Bought myself a lovely mic for this one, because I'm going to mic the guys up slightly differently to how I used to do it. 
If you don't know what a lavalier mic is, it's basically one of them mics that you clip on. Obviously you hide it in the clothes and then you have the little receiver in the back pocket, the recorder. That plugs in. I'm going to use a Zoom H1. That's going to plug in and record the audio of some of the speeches and some of the people who are talking. But now I need to do my prep for it. I'm going to check out a couple of songs. I use the music bed for my tracks actually. Um, so if any of you guys are looking for like really, really good music for your videos and stuff like that and for your clients, go onto the music bed and they've got some sick sick tracks on there like you can check out the genre um like the mood and stuff like that and it like you can really kind of pinpoint the right feel for your project and also i have to do it for my second shoot which is on sunday really really need to be a bit careful with how i'm going to do this i'm going to put a lot of work in for it so i should be sick see you in a bit mm-hmm what i go on just need to prep all my stuff now because I've got a two camera set up. I'm going to shoot with two cameras behind where the groom is. I will actually do a proper vlog on how I kind of do my wedding setups. Um, obviously I don't do them the same every time because I want them to be like personal to each different client. But um, there is kind of like the guidelines that you kind of have to get when you do weddings. I've got two cameras to prep. There's not that much, just got to make sure that all the sensors are completely clean, everything's looking good. All the cards are completely refreshed. All the batteries are up to date and clean. Going to take the drone, obviously I can't charge for drone stuff just yet because my license hasn't come through yet. But yeah, got to make sure it's safe and all stuff like that and do my pre-flight checks and all of the paperwork that comes with flying a drone properly. Sweet. Have a good weekend everyone, later on.